family. Hey, what's up with you guys? It is March the 2nd, 2017, and I have come on just to simply say, what's up? What's up, guys? What's up, family? It's been a long time. We ain't caught up in a long time. We ain't talked no shit in a long time. So, being in that, it is our anniversary month. Can y'all believe that shit? Anniversary month. I believe it was the 6th of March, 2010. I think I did my first video March 8th, 2010. Check that out. So it's been seven years. Seven. Can you believe that shit? I can't believe it. I'm like, wow, what the fuck happened? Like, how did we get from there and made it all the way over here? And then to look at the progression... To look at the things that I went through, all of the, man, it was a lot. It was a lot. But, over 15 million views later, that's considered as diamond status. Do you understand what I'm saying? That is considered as diamond status. So, to make it to that, um, for those of you guys that don't know, you know, like with record sales, it goes gold, platinum, then diamond. And I believe, I want to say gold is somewhere around, I don't know, 500,000 or something. And then when you get to platinum, maybe it's a million, I think, guys. Don't quote me on it. Y'all let me know that. But I do know that diamond is anything over 10 million. So to have made it to over uh, 15 million views is a lot. You know, it's an accomplishment. And I just thank you guys so much. You know, um, and the emails from the powers that be, I thank you guys. Now, I, you know, it's been a long road. Your girl be inconsistent, you know what I mean? Um, and I got what you guys want me to do. I got it, and let's do it. You know, let's do it. You know, I think, I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready. I think I'm finally ready. It's been so many things that I have gone through within these seven years. We've grown a lot, haven't we? Oh, my God, we done been through so much motherfucking bullshit, came on this motherfucker clowning, huh? We been clowning from the time we stepped foot on this bitch here, okay? So, before we get into all that, though, um, we're not kicking nobody out the room. So, Clyde, don't worry about it. Uh, Curtis and Cornelius, niggas, don't worry about it. Let them all in. Big Bertha, all y'all, come on in this mother. Ethel, come in this motherfucker, baby. Come on in here. We ain't doing nothing but catching up. Spring about to jump off. You know what I'm saying? Motherfucking California. Sorry about that. Shit cut off and I wasn't through. <laughs> the batteries had went out. But yeah, anyway, California is moist. You know, we've been in a drought out here for a long time. Like real shit. Like 100 shit right now. Like really, I'm, I'm like serious right now. Motherfuckers couldn't wash their cars outside, right? You know what I'm saying? Neighbors telling them motherfuckers, if you had water going out like on the sidewalk and in the gutters and shit like that, nigga, that was a fine. The neighbors can say, okay, look, check this out. I really don't like that bitch. No way been fucking her husband since 83. I'm getting ready to go ahead on and take a picture of this right here, nigga, and I'm about to send this to East Valley Water District. You know what I mean? Let them know what's happening over there that they wasting water. You know what I'm saying? Now you got a ticket coming in the mail. Ain't that a bitch? Motherfuckers can call on you like they calling the welfare on you. It was like that when it came down to water. So, but being that we done had so much motherfucking water dams and shit breaking like water going north. Niggas getting swept up the river like motherfuckers is in Mississippi. You feel me? Motherfuckers been outside with all goddamn inner tubes and shit in the middle of the street. You follow me goddamn there in South Central LA. We done had so much motherfucking rain, we don't even know what to do. Like, really, niggas ain't, niggas is like just standing on the porch like, niggas, what we about to do, nigga? What's happening here? You know what I'm saying? Grass and shit starting to grow. You understand? My motherfucking get out out here now. Look, check this out. Look. <clears throat> Come in closer. Because I ain't going to say this, but one motherfucking time. Okay? Because y'all already know what season it is. Okay? Y'all know what season it is. Let's just go and get it out there for those who, th those of us that's, you know, is medicinal worthy. You know what I'm saying? And you trying to do your thing at the house. I ain't got to go all the way in on what I'm talking about. But those of y'all that know what time it is, baby, you know what it is. Okay? So, 
Let me give you the steps on where you need to be right now. So then, therefore, when harvest come in, nigga, it's going to be... Ooh, 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 hey, Mary J. Hey, dun, 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 dun. Okay, this is what you're going to do. You ready? Okay, this is what you're going to do. First of all, I'm going to need you to start your clones off with Ocean Forest. Okay, it's made by Fox Form. You might want to Google it and figure it out. It's called, it's made, the, the maker of it is called Fox Form. The soil is going to be called Ocean Forest. Okay, so you want to start off your clones or whatever you're going to do. If you've already done your seedlings or whatever, and now you're on um, repotting them, you're to that stage now. Then what you want to do is you want to repot them in Ocean Forest. Okay. Now, as the roots begin to take uh, take hold and you go out there and you kind of tug at it a little bit and it's giving you some resistance, that's letting you know that now it's getting comfortable in the states. The leaves and all that kind of stuff is real perky and you can see the veins in them real good. Okay, now it's taking hold. It's taking effect. Now you want to water it three capfuls to one gallon of water. I ain't got no notes. Nigga just on one right now. Don't worry about it. You understand me? I'm just impromptu. It's what it is. My tea is high. But you want to go three capsules to one gallon of water. A couple times out the week. Now you're going to give it a feeding, say, for instance, on Monday. And then you're going to, you want to make sure when you water your, your what you call it, you want to make sure you really flush them well. Because you're not going to be watering them every day. That's what you're not going to do because otherwise you're going to have root rot and all that other kind of shit because now the soil is too soggy. This needs to be dry. You know, they thrive in the heat, you know. So the hotter the climate is, the better the get down going to be. Now, you kind of want to grow them more like west-southwest position. If you got it on the slant, check this out. It's going to be better for you. Now, uh, I know I probably ain't, I'm probably out of compliance. I don't know. But for those of you guys that understand what's happening, no, that's what's happening. So you want to get you some H.O., look it up. It's called H.O. on the thing, on the bottle, it's, gonna, it's called grow. That is when you are in the vegetative stage, okay? It goes in three stages. Now, for those of you guys that are motherfucking veterans and y'all motherfuckers on Teach and Chum, y'all been doing this shit since 73, then therefore, if I'm wrong on something, come down in the motherfucking comments and straighten me out. Do you understand what I'm saying? But I'm just giving what I know. Impromptu, no notes. I ain't got no Google shit on the side. I ain't got the iPad propped up over there and just telling me what to do because how would I be able to scroll down? You know what I'm saying? Motherfucker getting a little up there. I got to have me some readers on sometime. So I can't do all that. So I'm just telling you what I know just offhand. You with me? Okay. So, it goes vegetation stage. <clears throat> vegetation stage is when you want to build these nice, strong root systems. You know what I'm saying? Just like I was telling baby, uh, I tell him, I was just telling him yesterday. When you have a really strong root system, you never have to worry about the wind. So just let that marinate for a minute. I'm going to just ask that y'all go on and take all that in for a minute. Think about it. You know what I'm saying? Think about it. You know? So, yeah. So, at any rate, but when you're at this vegetation state, you want to build strong roots. That's what old age is going to do. It's going to make the roots, you know, really sprout out, you know. And um, based on which one you're going to do, because you're going to have three different strains, I don't need to go through all of that. But, you know, based on which ones, whether or not you're growing in pots or you're growing in, you know, your soil that you've prepped in the backyard. Hopefully, you guys have been getting your mulch uh, uh, built up um, the last few months because that's what you want to continuously feed her. You know, you want to constantly feed them compost, which is black gold, good shit that you done took out of your kitchen after, you know what I'm saying, you done made some tacos and shit and the, the old ass lettuce and tomato and motherfucking green onion and all that old type shit there. Then therefore, before you get to putting the sauce and shit on it, I'm talking about the ones that's in the bottom of the refrigerator, got water on it now and the colors and shit done changed up a little bit. Some of it got a little fuzz on it. That shit there. You want to put all that in your compost drum. Okay, with your old ass flowers from motherfucking um, 
Valentine Day and all the old bullshit when you're raking the leaves. Now here come the spring and all you cleaning shit up. All of the leaves and all that good shit. You also want to do like eggshells. But the thing is with eggshells, it's a dairy product. So what you want to do first is you want to bake them motherfuckers in the oven before you put them in your compost because they have to be all the way dried out. And then because you want the nutrients of them in your soil, okay? Also, um, coffee grinds. Like right here, um, I got some coffee grinds that I took out of my curate when I got ready to make my coffee this morning. Y'all know that's a regular. But yeah, here go my coffee grinds right here. And I'm going to um, put them outside in my compost um, in a minute because I also give them this. I also um, feed them ash. You know, ash from... Like my, you know what I'm saying, get down with the get down, you know what I'm saying? I recycle all that shit. I put all that shit back in the soil, flip that on in on that right there, and the next nigga is growing some of me, you know what I'm saying? My DNA is running through that motherfucker, huh? So yeah, I don't waste shit, you know what I mean? Uh, and this is just the way that I live. Believe it or not, I'm, you know, I'm a low-key throw-it-off ass motherfucker, but I'm green and I, you know, I recycle and... You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm a nigga that's, you know, third eye sharp. You know what I mean? I'm one of them that, you know, I'm just trying to give it to you in a certain way to where some people can understand it. To where I can come on here and say all kind of crazy shit. You know, I can talk with the best of motherfuckers on whatever we're talking about. But you're going to miss some people. You know what I'm saying? And see, like, my play cousin, them, they understand where I'm coming from when I'm talking to them like this right here. You know what I mean? We, nigga, we communicating everything. We probably playing spades, motherfucking dominoes, whatever, putting one up. You know what I'm saying? This nigga over here on Kavasi, this nigga over here on Black Velvet, but nigga, everything go. You know what I mean? Them niggas doing brown, them niggas doing white, what? You know what I mean? Yeah. My, myself, personally, though, nigga, you give me some Gorilla Glue, nigga, I'm, a, I'm, I'm on stuck status. You know what I mean? I'm laughing at these motherfuckers saying some dumb ass shit, you know. So, this is just how I get down. So, but if it ain't your thing, check this out. You ain't got to be in this tilt, though. You ain't got to sit in here with me. Because this is how I get down. I've been this same nigga since uh, 2010, 2011. They been all right with it, you know what I'm saying? They ain't shut a bitch off and nothing like that, you know what I'm saying? They treat me nicely, you know what I mean? Motherfucker got a little award and all that old type of shit. Got some real cool shit. Got invited all down to the headquarters and every goddamn thing. I love y'all. Thank you. You know what I'm saying? It's been seven motherfucking years. I can't even believe it. I'm fucked up. I'm, I'm just, uh, I just don't even know what to say and shit. I want to say I want to do a whole bunch of shit, but shit, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes the shit don't add up and the nigga jump out of compliance real quick. Be like, wait a minute, didn't you say you was going to do this regularly? Yeah, I know I said it. Damn. I know I said a whole bunch of shit. But y'all don't understand. I'll be having all kind of shit going on in my personal life. But we're going to talk about that shit in a few minutes because right now we was just talking about vegetative stages and we was talking about the three stages, right? So get your pen and pad back out because I just got a little diverted for a minute. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. You know what I mean? Nigga, had one up. You know what I mean? Little cup of coffee to go with. You know what I mean? You know? So there it is. Um, but uh, anyway, so you got the vegetative state. You want to use old age because you want the roots to really grow out and all that kind of stuff. If you're growing in a pot, you definitely want at least a 10-gallon pot. You know what I mean? You want something that's really big because you really want the, the roots to really extend themselves. And once the roots touch something or feel that there's a bottom, then they become they, they become stagnant and it's not going to grow no bigger than that now because now it feels like, okay, well, shit, I'm just confined to this space right here, so now let me get in the flower, you know what I mean? And when the that's the next stage is the flowering stage when it begins to bud. When it gets to that stage right there, then you want to give it what is called bloom, okay? It's in a, a tall bottle. It has a green label on it, and it's called bloom, but... um. Um, and you still want to regularly get, and you want to do that also with, with, that's also a concentrate. And I believe, um, I want to say like maybe one cap full to a gallon of water or something to that effect. Um, I don't have these bottles before me. I'm just going off, you know what I'm saying? Right off the dome. So if I'm wrong on some shit, nigga, hey, and your shit don't turn out right. Motherfucker, don't you call me come talking about nigga, uh, I done fucked up a whole house of weed. I don't know what the fuck happened. Nigga, I put it in there like it's said. If something happened, don't you contact me, goddammit. Because I'm going to ask that nigga, everybody got Google. See, back in our motherfucking day, nigga, we had Britannica, nigga. We had a whole side of motherfucking encyclopedias that sat on the side that was dusty than the motherfucker. 
that mama and them done bought from somebody that was walking down the street. That's what that was our shit. If it was not in them botanical motherfucking encyclopedias, nigga, it didn't exist. I'm just telling you the truth. The shit just did not exist, okay? But now we're in the era now that motherfuckers got internet and Google and this and that and this and this and this and bigbooty.com and fuck who you want to dot net and all that old type shit. Man, a hey, motherfuckers don't know how to act no more. It's fucking up everything, ain't it? Nigga, that shit is fucking up every motherfucker. Okay, I thought my baby was calling and shit. I thought that was our motherfucking song and shit. But yeah, um, all that old type of shit be going down nowadays. You know what I mean? So it's like, shit, nigga, you got Google. Don't contact me, nigga, with a half ounce fuck up. I'm going to need your motherfucking ass to Google this shit right here on what I'm talking about. And all the name of this shit, I might got one letter wrong. I might be saying it the wrong kind of goddamn way. But goddamn it, I'm giving you enough to work with. You know what I'm saying? I'm giving, I'm giving you, I'm giving you, a, I'm giving you a cold ass motherfucking start off, okay? Now if the shit don't work out right and you ain't out there talking to it like you need to, I ain't got nothing to do with that. That ain't none of my business. Now, don't contact me, okay? Cause I'm gonna cut your motherfucking ass out on the spot, motherfucker. Is you calling me about some motherfucking shit, nigga? Is you talking about some chocolate tie, nigga? If you don't get off my goddamn phone talking about this motherfucking nigga, you nigga, this nigga got Obama going. Don't call me, goddamn it. I'm telling you right now. Do not call me over your motherfucking Skywalker OG didn't turn out right. I don't want to hear nothing about it. I'm just telling you, okay? I'm giving you the basics on what it is that you need to know so then therefore you can get your shit on 10. You know what I'm saying? And then therefore by 4th of July when motherfuckers... Will, well, shit, I'm going to have some music festival so I might not be able... You know what I'm saying? I ain't going to fuck with the airlines. Fuck that. Nigga is trying to get home when I'm supposed to. So, nah... <clears throat> Now, I might uh, probably, you know what I'm saying, have baby hit up a nigga in the fifth ward or something. See if we can get a dime back from this motherfucker. We need something, goddamn it, edible or something in this motherfucker. I don't know what they got, goddamn, down there in New Orleans. I don't know. First 48 got me scared. But, you know, all I'm saying is Essence Music Festival 2017. The lineup, I don't know about it, but nigga, I'm going to be on Bourbon Street at the motherfucking swamp, nigga, riding that mechanical bull. I got to do it. You know what I'm saying? I got to. You know what I mean? Motherfucker feel good about herself nowadays. You know what I'm saying? Nigga ain't never been this motherfucker in shape before in her life. Nigga fucking different now. You know what I mean? Nigga, if you don't put your motherfucking arm back, nigga, and twist my leg all the way to the back of my motherfucking head. Yeah. Whole different tilt. Whole different motherfucking tilt. You better understand. You ass this nigga I know.